everyone in Blade Wild released another update and let's go through everything that's inside of this update. So let's start off with this part of the update, the Ether Blade. This Ether Blade is of course dual wield or normal with one and it looks pretty sick. If you guys do want this weapon, check out my Discord. I will be giving it away to a viewer. So join while you still can. So these are the newest Ether Blade dual wield max upgrades. They look pretty cool. And this is this is the nor this is the normal version without it being upgraded. This is the normal single wield version. Oh, okay. So once you buy it to upgrade it, it's it's two percent chance of success. This is the max upgrade single version of that weapon. The next part of this update is the newest mode duels. So when you click this mode, you have options. So you can invite people and go all go into the same server in duels, or you can just start it by yourself and go into that server. Okay, so we are now in the duels mode, and as you can already see, it's very different and very cool. So the first thing we want to look at is the wins leaderboard. The duels mode has their own wins, so it's not the wins you have in total, it's the wins you get from duels. And there's two colors on your thing, blue and red. Red is how many losses you have in duels, and wins and blue is how many wins you have. Oh, there goes a new pillar sword. I'm the developer of the game. <laughs> Everyone's chasing the developer. Anyways, the second part of this duels mode is 1v1 duels. You first one other person, 2v2 duels, and 4v4 duels. So how duels work, there's a total of six rounds and the first to win three of those wins the game. That's all you need to know about duels. So to give you an example, here it is. There's one, two, three, one, two, three, and then there's six total. And first to win three on their side wins all the duels. And there we go, round lost. Now let me win a round for you guys to see how it looks when you lose a round. And there we go round one and this is how the ending screen looks and my bad there's only five rounds it's first to three not six now the next change from this gui would be the training mode as you can see if you press multiplayer here you can join other players servers or create your own you can have a maximum of 30 players in your server you can select which map you can select the game mode to randomizer normal two team four team and you can name the room so other than that there is one change to the training mode which is the target boss this one if you press yes the bots will target each other and if you press no the bots will only target you the final thing but not that major is this one right here every time you hit the ball it will go up by one the next best part of this update is the newest skill i have gone to a deep dive into this in my previous video i will link it in the description but it is pulse and it costs you ten thousand to get it and five thousand to upgrade for first and 10,000 to get second upgrade. So what this ability basically does is it hits everyone on the map and doesn't let anyone use two their modes. abilities. Two new maps, Underworld and Ocean. Let's take a look at both of them. So this is a new water map. It's kind of cool. You guys already saw the Underworld map, but here it is again from our point of view. It's really cool. Would have been better if they released this on Halloween. As you can see, there is a new mode here called Randomizer. So what randomizer is, it'll just put everyone in the thing and it'll select a random ability for you guys to use while you are playing the game. So it's basically like gun game, except you don't upgrade your abilities, you just get one ability. That is all for the update. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you guys subscribe and join our Discord and comment your username down below to be entered in the giveaway for the new Ethereal Blade. Thank you all for watching, see you in the next one.